Hello everyone. Today, we will go through the steps to link two pages in Figma. If you are working on a design project and need to connect different pages for navigation or prototyping, Figma allows you to create seamless links between them. This is useful when building interactive prototypes, user flows, or multi-page designs. Start by opening your Figma file. If you have not already created two pages, you can do so by going to the Pages panel on the left side of the screen. Click on the plus icon to add a new page, then name it accordingly. You can switch between pages by clicking on them in the panel. Now, go to the page where you want to create the link. Select the frame or object that will act as the button or clickable element. This could be a button, a text element, or any other interactive component. Once you have selected the object, look at the right side panel and click on the Prototype tab. This will allow you to create interactive connections. With the object still selected, look for the small blue circle next to it. Click and drag this circle towards the right until you see a line appear. Now, drag the line over to the other page that you want to link to. When you release the mouse, Figma will create a connection between the two pages. A settings panel will appear, allowing you to customize the interaction. Under the Interaction section, choose the trigger type. The most common option is On Click, which means the link will be activated when the user clicks on the object. You can also select other triggers such as While Hovering or After Delay, depending on your design needs. Next, select the action type. For linking pages, choose Navigate To and select the page you want to link. You can also adjust the animation style. The default is Instant, but you can change it to Dissolve, Slide In or Push to create smoother transitions between pages. Once you have configured the settings, click anywhere outside the panel to save the changes. Now you can test the link by going to the Play button in the top right corner. This will open the prototype mode, allowing you to interact with your design. Click on the linked object to see if it navigates to the correct page. If you need to edit the link, go back to the Prototype tab, click on the connection line and adjust the settings as needed. You can also delete the link by selecting the line and pressing the Delete key. This method allows you to create simple page navigation in Figma. If you are working on a more complex project, you can use additional features like overlays, variables and interactive components to enhance your prototype. That's it for this video. Thanks for watching.